The main hall of the city is the Arriaga Theater, reopened in 1985 as a municipal venue with a varied repertoire that includes dancing, opera, live music and theater. Also very active are the Campos Elysios Theater and the Euskaldana Concert Hall. Other important venues include La Fundición, dedicated to contemporary dances and theater, the Pabellón 6, the Sala BBK and the Escunas and Troa. Bilbao has more than a dozen museums covering a range of fields including art, science and sport, which have played a central role in Bilbao being named one of the most creative cities in the world. The Guggenheim Museum Bilbao, part of the Solomon R. Guggenheim Foundation, was inaugurated on October 19, 1997 and is work of the Canadian architect Frank Gehry. The museum's permanent collection is centered in the visual arts of the second half of the 20th century and the present, with relevant artworks from Richard Serra and Jeff Koons, although including as well temporary exhibitions with a more varied nature, like Russian art or engravings from Albrecht Dürer. Another important museum is the Bilbao Fine Arts Museum, first established in 1908 and housing a notable collection of Spanish and European work from the 12th century to present times. The collection from before the 20th century is centered mainly around Spanish and Flemish artists such as El Greco, Francisco de Sorberon, Bartolomé Esteban Murillo, Francisco Goya and Anthony Van Dyck. The museum also holds one of the best collections of Basque art, with works from the 19th century to present times. It has an eye-catching collection of avant-garde art, from the post-impressionism of Paul Gauguin to pop art, and the expressionism of Francis Bacon. The Basque Museum showcases Basque archaeology and ethnography, and holds frequent exhibitions in the area of Basque history. The museum building itself is part of the heritage listing Conjunto Histórico. The city also has several specialized museums, like the Maritime Museum Estuary of Bilbao, located next to the Estuary of Bilbao, which holds ships and other collection related to the region's fishing and shipbuilding culture, being particularly relevant the Corolla Crane, last remaining element of the Euskaldana shipyard that existed where the museum now stands. Other relevant museums are the Biscayan Archaeological Museum which holds important collections related to the region's prehistory, and the Diocesan Museum of Religious Art, both located in the Casco Viejo Quarter. The Euskaldana Concert Hall is home to frequent musical performances and it is home of the Bilbao Symphony Orchestra and the opera season programmed by the Abao. The Arriaga Theatre is frequently the host of numerous musical events, other notable stages include the Philharmonic Society of Bilbao and Bilbarock. The city hosts many different musical festivities, often funded by the City Hall. Due to its scope, it is especially relevant the Bilbao BBK Live Festival, which has been celebrated every year since 2006 and focuses on Basque, Spanish and international pop and rock music. Since the opening of the new San Mames Stadium in 2013, it has been often used as an open-air concert venue, the first ever concert being one from the American band Guns N' Roses in 2017. Other relevant music festivals include the Bilbao Distrito Jazz and the Bilbao R Sacrum, the latter dedicated to religious music. Bilbao is the birthplace of famous composer Juan Crisostomo Arriaga, who lived his formative years in the city before moving to Paris at age 15. Also native from Bilbao were the soprano singer Josefa Cruz de Gassier and Natividad Alvarez, nicknamed Nadi, La Bilbanita a dancer and castanets player who achieved national fame in the early 20th century. Also relevant is the Bilbao Choir Society established in 1866. Important musical bands coming from the city include rock band Fido and Fidipaldis, Basque folk band Oscori and folk pop band Mosedados. Bilbao hosted the 2018 MTV Europe Music Awards. Bilbao hosts several regular festivals and events. The most relevant is the Big Week of the City, celebrated annually since 1978 and lasting nine days. It is the city's main festival, attracting over 1,500,000 people every year. The festivities begin on the first Saturday before 22nd of August, and during those nine days the City Hall organizes a series of cultural events of diverse kind, including concerts, stage plays, Basque rural sports and bullfighting, as well as nightly firework displays. The festivities begin with the Chupinazo or Chupinazo, which is the launch of a small rocket, and the reading of a proclamation by the festivities herald. The central point of the festivities is the place around the Tosnas, where the different Compertsak are reunited, organized by neighborhood associations as well as cultural, social and political groups. The symbol of the festivities is Marie Haya, a large doll which is burned during the last day of celebrations. Beyond the main festivities of the Oste Naguja, the city also celebrates some minor festivities, many of them religious in nature, such as St. Agatha on 5th of February, the celebrations of Our Lady of Begonia on 11th of October, the Day of Thomas the Apostle on 21st of December and the Christmas festivities, centered around the figure of Olensero. There are also festivities in the different neighborhoods and districts which are celebrated locally, 
such as the Fiestas del Carmen in Santuxu and Indaxu, Fiestas Santiago in Bilbao La Vieja, Fiestas San Ignacio in San Ignacio and Fiestas San Roque in Arxtanda and Larasquichu. The city also hosts the International Festival of Documentary and Short Film under the commercial name of Zimbi. It was first held in 1959 under the name International Festival of Ibero-American and Filipino Documentary Film of Bilbao, with the goal of being complementary to the San Sebastián International Film Festival. Since 1981 it is organized by the City Hall and takes place in the Arriaga Theatre. Bilbao is also the host of the Sailin Festival, a yearly event centered exclusively around sailing, which brings together international representatives of this sport. Traditional Bilbao dishes are centered around products from the sea and the estuary, such as eels and cod. For the most part Bilbao shares its original gastronomy with that of the province of Biscay, including dishes such as bacalao al pil pil, bacalao a la Vizcaína, merluza and salsa verde, chiperones and su tinta, moros a la Vizcaína, revuelta de perchicos and desserts such as canutilos de Bilbao, panxineta, rice cakes and balas de Montequilla. Bilbao, as other Basque cities, is known for a variety of appetizers and snacks, being prominent among them the pincho, which are typically eaten in bars and that consist of small slices of bread on top of which is placed an ingredient or mixture of ingredients, generally of many different types and usually including elements typical of Basque cuisine. Other snacks include rabas, Spanish omelette, xampis, triangulos gildas. In what refers to beverages, typical from the region is the xacoli, a white wine usually drunk as an aperitif. Biscayne Sicoli is a protected denomination to origin for the white wine produced in the province of Biscay and it is usually served in Bilbao. Also typical are cider, pacharan and rioa wine. There are many restaurants and bars who serve these dishes and beverages, especially around the Casco Viejo Quarter. Chocos are also a very popular institution in Bilbao, as in other Basque cities and towns. Bilbao, and the province of Biscay as a whole, is one of the Spanish cities with a greater number of recognized restaurants by the gastronomic guides, among them several Michelin-starred restaurants.